Listen to me, precious people. At this place, there may be people that cannot walk. Probably you cannot walk for some reason or the other. Probably weak legs. I've seen some woman here with, I think it was a lame leg or something. Whichever the reason, whatever the reason for which you cannot walk, the Lord is coming to touch you now. I see a foot. It, is, it looks like it's a left leg. I don't know why there is one toe which is missing or something. I don't know. You know yourself better, but I'm only telling you what I see. You are standing on two legs, but the left leg, I think, is as if one toe is on top of the other or is missing. Whatever the case, it does not really matter. What matters is that the heavens are open here now and the Lord is ministering to you. He's going to minister to your condition and deliver you and help you. come to me <laughs> that's amazing that I saw your foot and I knew it was the left foot <laughs> Jesus is Lord come my daughter to ask her what's her name in the language she understands best oh she speaks Swahili. you people speak Swahili right thank you so much where are you from from Burundi you came from Burundi thank you when did you come Olikujalini. Na miezi sita. You have been here for six months, miezi sita. Sasa wakati ulikuja, ni nini alikuwa anakusumbua? When you came, you have been here for six months. What was the problem? Ngu. Uh -huh. Na kidonda kiko pale chini ya mguu. That this foot has been the problem and the wound was underneath. Uh -huh. You had diabetes. Mm, and diabetes. Yes. Uh, so, uh, so you are diabetic. You were diabetic. Na nini? Kuna chenye kilikuwa kimefunga ulimi nilikuwa siseme vizuri. Kuna chenye kilikuwa kinavuta ulimi. So something was pulling your tongue. Kula kitu kilikuwa kinavuta ulimi. She's saying that something was pulling her tongue and she could not speak well. Nilikuona, nilikuona bwana akanionyesha wewe. Akas, yeah, the Lord showed you to me. Akaniambia ni mguu ya kushoto. The Lord told me it was the left leg. Nikatangaza hapa juu. And I announced it here. I see a foot. It, is, it looks like it's a left leg. I don't know why there is one toe which is missing or something. I don't know. You know yourself better. But I'm only telling you what I see. You are standing on two legs. But the left leg, I think, is as if one toe is on top of the other or is missing. Whatever the case, it does not really matter. What matters is that the heavens are open here now and the Lord is ministering to you. He's going to minister to your condition and deliver you and help you. So tell me, Sasa, when did you know that the Lord has touched you? Nilini ulijua ulihisi vipi wakati bwana ale kuguza hivi? Ulijuaje bwana ame kuguza? How did you know the Lord touched you? I, I know you're, you're going to talk about how you couldn't walk, but that moment, Niliona kuna kitu kilishuka kikateremka kwenye kichu. Alafu shuka kutoka wapi? Mbingu. That's amazing. Kilishuka. Kinafanana na damu. Hey. <coughs> what she's saying is big precious people. She's saying something descended from heaven which looks like blood. Kiko kama chongo hivi. Iko kama chongo chongo is what? A sharp. Like a sharp thing. Uh -huh. You saw it there, descending on you there. 
Ni nilikuwa nimekaa pale ndo nikaona alafu nikaona samba la mwezi samba la mwezi zwa ah kuna nani the when the sun the sunshine then she saw the sun eh okay ndo nikasikia mguu unabaki unauma hakuna uma hivi nyanya niki nene oh he felt like the there was some guessing in the foot some guess guess what this guessing some gas coming out yes, yes. some gas came out of the foot that's amazing though lakini mbe ni kwa nasikia some some mikuki na na choma and she could feel some sharps in the in the same foot thank you so much sharp not mikuki sharp sharp like something piercing right that's the right translation lakini visi visike nasikia tu vinavuta vuta tu now he, he feel very very, uh, very good cause only f- she felt something pulling pulling a little bit by, by little so that is the moment she realized she was healed so, so big things happened here inside here there has been a visitation here talk to me you bear testimony that your mother could not speak well she could speak well because of the diabetes or, or it was pulling back the um, the tongue so the diabetes was pulling back the tongue yes that is uh, shocking yes when when she is talking it was very hard for her to to speak out and when when you, you, you with her it was very hard to hear what she is talking about oh, 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 oh. okay we are standing on the verge of a big miracle here this is big this is very big sasa sema yesu yesu bwana bwana hallelujah Hallelujah. 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 Jesus. Jesus. Yesu. Yesu. Ni Bwana. Ni Bwana. see a girl stand up so it looks like the lord is going to heal i don't know why she stands up and walks in whitish cloth i think it's a girl or, or a woman but but i see that uh, a cloth which is is it grayish with little touches of black stripes or whatever a hip injury she could not walk my lord but she is now able to walk hip replacement they said so you are the one I was seeing in the dream yeah because now i'm beginning to see the white cloth with streaks of black right oh ah uh, really 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 this is mighty <laughs> only now i saw the cloth i see a girl stand up So it looks like the Lord is going to heal. I don't know why she stands up and walks in whitish cloth. A cloth which is is it grayish with little touches of black stripes or whatever. This is mighty. <laughs> I say it in the conference. Even me just now I realized that's the lady. Were you in the conference? No. Ah. No more hip replacements. Ah, 
she is healed totally healed look at that look at that look at that look at that I'm Slindy Lekati you are from here yes. you are South African yes that is very powerful what was your condition what did the doctors say doctor told me that they will do a hip replacement for me because my hip is very damaged oh so the doctors used all machines they have and they examined your hip and they found out that is very damaged so what happened to you that uh, you, that uh, that uh, that uh, your hip was damaged i fell 14 years ago 14 years ago it's amazing because i saw your cloth yesterday in, even in the conference i was talking to them that there's a lady that's going to be healed she walks here i don't know why you were walking like that in the conference as if you were walking like i mean what when the lord presented you to me how bad was what was that yes i was limping. you couldn't walk properly yes. i couldn't bend you couldn't bend i couldn't walk properly and i couldn't walk really long distance yeah. when you were there how did you know the lord has touched you i feel so much power of god so much power i had no, the hand of god touches me you feel the hand of god touch you touch where your body where everywhere in my leg. Or what? the whole leg the, you felt the hand of god touch your whole leg yes and it was trembling and it was trembling eh? yes that is mighty <laughs> she said she could never touch her knee can you t well, look at that uh uh I see someone, I think it's a wound you have or something. I saw it already. It looks very ugly. That's what I mean. Chronic wounds. My Lord, this young man hey. had an STID disease hey. because he's, he's a lot of pain also. Hey. And when you prayed, <laughs> he felt it disappear. It is the young man I was talking about. I saw everything. You know me, I get to see people. I see everything. That's why I was able to see you in that condition. And announcing up here. And I said a young man. Then I said, I'm not sure whether you're young or not, but it's a young man. So now, you want to talk to me. Tell me, what happened? What's your name? From where? Zimbabwe, how bad was your condition? You went into sexual sin. My situation is so bad. I vomit every time. It, 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 it. Your situation was so bad. Yes. When I took tablets. Yes. Yeah. I, uh, and there was no improvement. Yes. Because even the Lord so showed me also the swelling. I know everything. Yeah. Even now, my chest is paining. Even right now as you speak. Yeah. Can you but go there and check and come back to me? Go to the restroom and check and come back to me and tell me what you see. Because me, I know all the detail. Yes, go there and check. So, have you checked for me? Yes, I did. Yeah, I'm okay, man. The swelling is down? Yeah. So, I thank you, sir. I'm in Jesus' name. You did a lot of work. I'm, I'm, I'm healed. That is powerful. You say he did a lot of work, not me. He did, right? Thank you, my son. So don't go back to sin. Don't go back to sin. You won't. My Lord, yes. this woman had a knee complication. She was due for an operation. And me. now she's totally healed. The pain has disappeared. She cannot walk. What couldn't she do? She was not able to walk freely. I am running to the cross. This is now South Africa running to the cross. South Africa is running to the cross. There is deliverance at the cross. There is revival at the cross. There is anointing at the cross. 
There is healing at the cross. There is blessing at the cross. There is eternity at the cross. There is the blood at the cross. <laughs> Hallelujah. 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 problem with my knee this with your knees the left knee. my left knee yes. but when you were praying here i had somebody was pulling my the lord touched people physically here today right there was some serious physical touch here because you said you had somebody pull your knee physically yes there was somebody pull, pull the leg or the knee he was pulling the leg in fact i had this knee the pain on this left knee and it was a severe one I had somebody pulling my knee and also my arm. This uh, pain has gone up to this, up to my shoulder. Even my leg was pulled. So that is how I was healed. That is so powerful. This uh, knee on my pain is affecting my work. I can't even work properly. I use the crutch when I'm going to work. When I'm going to work. It is done, my daughter. Thank you very much. Because you said you walked out of there. Someone touched your knee, your, your leg. It is also affecting my work uh, as, a, as a... What do you do? Worshiper. You're a worshiper, yes. Yes. No, but I now you are going to worship very well I without... I'm going to worship God as, as we had me. I could, I could hear your voice there. It was very powerful, yes. Sir. Yes. I'll do my work. Thank you so much. The Lord bless you. Just walk away with that knee now and make sure the doctor sees that knee also. It looks like very well now. The Lord bless you very much. Thank you so much. Say the Lord touch her physically. My father, there is this man you showed me his chest whatever the condition in the chest and the stomach Lord make him whole again I decree here my father in the mighty name of Jesus I decree here right now with my prophetic tongue that the healing anointing of the Lord has now come down here what has happened there this man hey had a blocked chest since 2010 but right now it opened up my son are you the one i was talking about someone that is opening the chest and showing me <laughs> you remember here and i said you are a man <laughs> because i could see the lines of the muscles and the man's chest right here i was seeing it right here <laughs> hallelujah hallelujah my father there is this man you showed me his chest whatever the condition in the chest and the stomach Lord make him whole again I decree here my father in the mighty name of Jesus I decree here right now with my prophetic tongue that the healing anointing of the Lord has now come down here I came here not for my benefit, but for the benefit of my cousin who, who, who hasn't worked for his entire life. But through the, 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 the means of God, 
uh, God uh, has chosen me to be the one who received the, the healing. Um, I wouldn't uh, spend uh, even 20 minutes without coughing. But mm. my, my, my chest was broken. Actually, I'm, I'm a heavy smoker, I must admit. Uh, but now the smoking is over. Yes. Um, uh, since you started to pronounce the healings, I haven't coughed. And my chest is is it is. Oh, thank you so much. So that was the chest, right? Thank you so much. The Lord bless you. Arthritis. How beautiful. That's why I saw her doing this. Yes, my Everybody Lord. receive your healing now. She says she could not do like this. She could not do what she's doing. She could not do what she's doing. The healing service has begun. Everybody receive your miracle. I'm Ellen Manana. Ellen Manana, come with me. Just walk with me. You, 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 you did for me things there. Are you going to run a little bit? Hallelujah. I'm very happy about that. I thank this lady who brought me here. She saw me at the, ho at the clinic. She came to me and talked about Jesus. I said, I will go with you because you said you're going on Saturday. I'm even going to my church on Sunday. You are even going to your church on Sunday? Yes. To talk to your pastor? Yes, I'm going to tell him and tell everybody that I'm healed. <laughs> this is very powerful. I'm again the arthritis very bad on my knees because I'm old. I'm 71 years old. My grandson is going to be very happy because he goes to church. Let's do it. and the cancers to dissolve in the mighty name of Jesus. What has happened over there? <laughs> Come over then. You didn't shout. I said shout. Something has happened over there, right? I, 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 the tumor is going, is going down. It's going down a little bit by bit by bit. <laughs> I told you, South Africa, I am coming, says the Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> no, but that one, that one is an instant miracle. <laughs> night he was showing me somebody i see some eyes i don't know whether the face looked like that person had uh, was bruised a bit or whatever but anyway i the, it's some eyes is the lord going to open eyes tomorrow blind eyes that i saw that this night in the dream
there may be people here who cannot see well or totally blind i don't know wherever you are but i've seen some blind eyes he's been ministering to me in the dreams about that but for whichever reason for whatever the reason that you are not able to see either see clearly or totally blind again that does not matter to the lord right now what matters is the blood of jesus that is still flowing and setting men free and setting women free and setting children free nations free lord touch blind eyes and open pop open those eyes that they may see clearly and read your word my lord tell me this woman had lost why are you crying why are you crying <laughs> i couldn't read the bible you couldn't do what i couldn't read the bible without you, you. couldn't read the bible i talked about you yesterday i talked about you yesterday in the conference <laughs> this night he was showing me somebody i see some eyes i don't know whether the face looked like that person had uh, was bruised a bit or whatever but anyway i the, some eyes is the lord going to open eyes tomorrow blind eyes that i saw that this night in the dream i looked for you i i knew the description of your face yesterday in the conference i couldn't read the bible without using that now now you, now you can read uh-uh somebody give me a bible with the smallest print on the earth let us see if she can read kwa vuga emva kuka abimeleki ukusindisa abaka israel do those words make sense she's reading right <laughs> hallelujah <laughs> man was bigger than this one uh, but now, uh, the zulu bible but i couldn't read without using the glasses now i can read hallelujah praise the lord <laughs> see what's your name Cladis. Cladis who? Muloisan. Muloisan. When did you realize that the Lord has just touched your eye? What happened? What did you feel? I felt as if there is something here. I, I don't know it like like <laughs> I took out this, something like this here. <laughs> How powerful glory to Jesus. Yes Lord. Yes Lord, have your way Lord. Why are you crying before the Lord? That's always what I want to know. Why is my daughter crying today? I've been having swollen brain. But the brain has been swollen for a long time. Which part has been swollen? This, this. I've been touching my head. I'm feeling the pain. I'm feeling the pain. So much pain. Now, when I touch my head again, I can't find the pain. Oh! Revival! First of all, uh, when I came here, I didn't come, I didn't come here for me. I just came here for my daughter. But at night the voice of the Lord, well, it was like I've done something wrong. It was like I've done a big sin. I said, "You in the morning, yesterday I wake up I was early rushing to your conference." The voice of the Lord The voice of the Lord like angry told you, "Wake up and go to the conference." Yo, it was in the morning at 3 o'clock in the morning. I said, "What's the time? It's 3." Oh no, Lord, I'm going today. I am going today. Then when you enter, I didn't see you at the conference, but I just felt it was like the ball. And I, I, I've got, I had a, a pain. It's been here for many years. Even my children are born out of this pain in my womb. Now I felt like it was all coming out. I wanted to go and check at the toilet. I said, when I look, oh, here is the man of God.
But I felt the pain, I felt the funny thing coming out first. Then when I went to check the toilet, oh, I, there's nothing wrong. I said, this is the man of God. I had an accident in 2004. I broke three broken ribs. Then the doctor said, no, it will heal anyway. But it doesn't heal. I said, okay, that's my thought. I'm not worried. And in my head, the doctor said, I've got swollen two parts. In my head, there's swollen uh, brain. I said, okay, that's my thought. So, so it was painful. Yes, yeah, so it was painful, right? It was painful. It was painful. Most people, when it's when it's hot, I couldn't go out when it's hot unless I wear two hats to cover my head. But I always said I will keep on preaching the word of God. It's my thorn. God will heal me one day. Now, when I'm standing here, there, when we're talking about the reefs, I, I, I said to my, no, it's not me. Then a few minutes, I I hear, I feel like it's a string. Like this in my in my ribs, I said to my younger daughter, "Who? What's that?" I just look at this. Who? What's that? Oh, it's nothing. Hi, bo. Then we talk about this pay. Like I said, oh no, no, God is not healing me today. Oh, it's not my time again. People keep keep on healing. People when coming. When you take the rib, pain went or what? Hi, bo. It just disappears like that. It was like <laughs> a, a string going like this in my ribs. I said, oh, what's that? It's like somebody was touching me. I said to my God, hey, bro, what's that? I said, okay, there's nothing. Hey, bro, the pain is gone. Then there's a pastor, lady pastor here. I said, hey, bro, where is this pain now? It's lost. Where is it? I'm, I keep on looking at the pain. I can't find it. How, can you give her the microphone? How bad was the pain in the head? It was painful. It I was bad. Even, I like to make, to make my hair like, oh, yes, because oh, yes. I don't want to add, uh, yes, Those yes. So, so the, the, the doctor said you have two months in the head? Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, swollen, swollen brain. Swollen it's been, brain. Yes, it's been there because they wanted to do the operation. I said, no, 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 no operation. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thank you indeed. I'm blessed. Thank you. Your name, Pastor? Tembi Zulu. From Amanzim Dot. Thank you so much. The Lord bless you. The, the high blood is too high. Yes. After this, I, I mean, got a stroke. After that, you did what? Stroke. Since since I I I had to go to stroke, I am not walking. I'm you since then you have never walked. You have not been walking for how long? Twenty as a, from twenty eleven. From twenty eleven, two thousand and eleven. Yeah. Which month? November. November 2011, until now you've not been walking. Talk to me. Yes. I'm very happy today because I'm walking now. You're very happy today because you got up today and walked. Yes. Thank you, God. <laughs> Thank you, my daughter. That's very powerful. I said I, I move when you are praying. You, you felt the leg move. That's amazing. I'm walking. And after that, you're walking. Yes. The Lord bless you very much and keep you and glorify Jesus all the days of your life, my daughter.